Hello everyone, this is Maja Nick here, welcome back to another video. So today, I'm going to be talking about why I think fusing pets is useless, and what you could do instead of fusing pets. So if we come over here to the supercomputer and go to the fuse pets section, you're going to see that it says select three plus pets, and this applies to stat pets. Obviously this doesn't apply to exclusives or huges, but the whole point is that you select uh, whatever pets that you want. Looks like you can't select some of them. I guess maybe if they're too like high of a rarity, but I believe with, yeah. So these I could select. These are the frostbite yetis. And the whole point of fusing pets is that you take a bunch of pets that I guess you don't really need. So I don't need these frostbite yetis. And you take a few of them and you combine them to make a better pet, which, you know, sounds not too bad. But here's the issue with this. So you could see that the power on it is 265 million and it costs only 50 gems to fuse. So that's not an issue. But look what happens when I take three of these 265 million pets and combine them into one. Let's see what I get. And look at that. It becomes one 231 million pet. So <laughs> it doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure this out. That is a terrible trade-off. You're putting in three of your good pets to get one worse pet. So let's try it with another pet that's maybe not as good. So we'll go down here. Let's say with this one, this is 223 million. So this time I'll throw in, how many can I do? Okay, I'll throw in 31 of these 223 million pets. Now let's see what I get you get one 247 million pet. Now that's combining 31 of your other pets instead of combining these, which yeah, if you combine a lot of the like worst pet, combine like 30 plus of them, yeah, you might get one better pet. And even if you go up to these higher ones, you're never gonna get anything that's better than like 247 million. So instead of combining these, wasting a lot of your pets in hopes to get one that's better, it's not guaranteed every time. Cause watch, I'll show you. I'll do another one with this 223 million pet let's do 31 again and there we go i got something that's no better i combined 31 pets for basically like the same uh, stat pet so instead of putting your pets in there i'm going to show you what you can do with them instead so as you can see, I'm now here in the trading plaza and I'm going to put some of these up for sale and I'm going to look at the wrap value as well. So I was making the example with these 231 million pets. So if you look where it says the actual price for them, they're about 213 diamonds each. If I were to sell those 31 pets instead of fusing them, that would give me, if I sold them for wrap value that is, that would give me 6,603 diamonds. Now let's go over to the stat pet that we got lucky with getting which is the 247 million one so it's a little bit higher only by like 16 million more and if we look at the price of just one of these would you look at that it's 589 diamonds each with the diamonds that we got from those we can buy multiple of the good pets that we only got one from combining so you're always gonna take a loss it seems when you're fusing these pets because you take a bunch of those lower stat pets you fuse them and you might get one that's better but if you had just sold those extra stat pets anyways you can buy the better ones that you need so it really the function of it i i see what they were trying to go for and i understand the thought process behind it but it was executed poorly and they should do something to fix it because as of right now it serves like literally no purpose at all it's so bad and i don't recommend it because you're just going to be losing value you could just sell your extra pets and then buy the ones that you actually need and buy multiple of them too that's not even the biggest problem i have with it the other problems that i have is that it wastes a lot of time so if you're hatching and let's say you don't have a good setup like for me my enchant setup is pretty good if you don't have like a bunch of high lucky egg books or you don't have a bunch of egg openings let's say you only have like 15 
15 at most and you have to hatch for a long time just to get one of those pets and I'll use the example again of the 231 million pet if it takes you a long time to get that and then you have to go ahead and try and combine 31 of them in hopes of getting the 247 million pet that's like a slap in the face you're just wasting your time you're wasting your time hatching and you're just going to be losing value in the long run and another point that I want to make is that this really only helps you if you have huges and exclusives so obviously the way that huges and exclusives work is based on your best stat pet so let's say like a new update drops and people are trying to rush to get the best stat pet and let's say you get lucky you combine a bunch of your lower stat pets and get a higher one okay cool well now it's benefiting all of your other exclusives and all of your other huges but it's not going to be benefiting people for that don't have those pets. So if you're relying on just stat pets and you're combining like 10 of your best stat pets in hopes to get one good one, even if you do get a better one, you're still losing out because now you only have one better pet and it's gonna take so much longer to break stuff. All around, it's just like a loss. There's really no point to fusing pets right now. And I really hope like in the future they decide to buff it. I don't know <laughs> what they would do to change it. Maybe they would make like the success rate of getting those better pets higher or maybe It'll take less pets to fuse in order to get the good ones but i hope that it does receive an update eventually because i see absolutely no value in it right now and i don't recommend anybody to fuse pets right now because it's just simply bad there's no way around it fusing pets is bad right now so don't do it sell your extra stat pets and then just buy the ones that you need you're way better off doing that and that's pretty much all i have to say about fusing pets and yeah i hope you found this video helpful if you did leave a like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye